What's up, y'all? This be your boy Scott, and you're watching yet another episode of The Bottom Line Is Only on YouTube. What's up, y'all? Um, this is my video of the back, not basketball halls. I'm so used to talking about them. Um, Bad Girls Club Seven, New Orleans, Episode Four. This is my review, and here's my notes. I finally wrote some notes down for this one, so um, it is what it is. My my um Bad Girls Club videos really looks like they they never um are very long so i don't think this one is going to be very long either so let me go on and get to the get down now first of all i want to address team real versus team boring and i must say that team real is really running shit right now and the season just started team boring is a damn mess you know you got shelly you got tasha you got priscilla priscilla look like she just looked nasty to me tasha from the previews i thought she was going to be cute but tasha got so many bags on her eyes. Tasha's not cute at all. And Shelly, her damn extensions and her weave is is horrible. Everything about it is horrible. And she got a damn a pot belly. And she just, everything about her just gives me Erica from the Miami bad girls. Like, I mean, she's just so annoying. That whole little group is annoying. And they all weak. And the thing that's killing me is that, you know, Team Born was trying to, you know, tug Judy between two groups and trying to make it seem like Nastasia was talking shit behind Judy back when she really was and all they were doing was making fun of her drinking when they do that in, the, in her face and I don't know what was the purpose of Tasha and Priscilla and Shelly to even do that shit you know what I'm saying trying to play them against each other like they are so miserable and all they do is sit around it sit around their house and think about what the fuck Judy doing all the time like that's all the fuck they talk about Judy 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 like they ain't got nothing else to talk about and then I mean, those hoes are so boring to me. And then, you know, Shelly and Priscilla had a talk outside about Nastasia and how, you know, she, you know, Priscilla was talking about how she didn't understand why, you know, Nastasia was so pissed off about, you know, the whole not putting the clothes in a dryer thing and all of that. And, you know what I'm saying? When it went back to the private screen and I saw that, um, this is what some shit that Shelly says. Shelly's saying that she don't like people that thinks that they're better than her. Bitch, are you fucking serious? Don't you think you better than Judy? You think that she a dirty bitch, but look at you. You look like a dirty bitch. Look at your hair. Your hair always in that wet-ass ponytail. Your extensions is a mess. They don't even match. So what are you talking about, bitch? Like, who are you to sit up here and try to judge somebody? And then you try to sit up here and say Nastasia thinks she's better than you? I don't necessarily think Nastasia thinks she's better than you. Clearly, you got insecure issues. Clearly, you got insecurities of your own because you think a bitch got their mind on you and thinking that they better than you. They don't think they better than you. They just don't pay your weak ass no mind because you a weak pussy ass bitch. That's why. Like, bitch, shut up. Like, you take everything to offense. Like... It's Shelly just Ooh, even you know, even though she reminds me so much of Erica, Erica didn't annoy me as much as Shelly is. Like, damn bitch, like this bitch is so annoying. Then I just wanna say this, I can't stand Tasha. Everything about Tasha annoys me, like her voice, she sound like she got a whole bunch of nuts stuck in her throat. Because she's got this raspy ass voice. She got some nuts stuck in her throat or something. That bitch is just stupid as fuck. I can't stand her. She's a fake ass bitch. She ain't even cute. She got all them bags on her eyes like she ain't had no sleep in about two, three weeks. Bitch, get a damn grip. Like, you ain't cute. You ain't shit. And you need to shut the fuck up. Like, you always running your mouth. You always talking about somebody embarrassing you. You ought to be embarrassed by the two bitches you keep close to you in the motherfucking house. Look at Priscilla and look at Shelly. You always talking about how Nastasia and Tierra and them are so fucking embarrassing. Look at the two dirty bitches you hang around with. And the way you put yourself on such a high pedestal, you wouldn't even be hanging around them dirty ass bitches if you were so much as you put yourself out to be. Bitch, please. Then, you got Nastasia and them at the day. After they left the little alligator shit, they went to a um dinner. And, you know what I'm saying? They were talking about chicken on the bone, and Nastasia was like, her mother doesn't do it, and she think it's a white people thing, because, you know, her mother is white, this and that, and the third, and then she like, trailer park white. I can see if she was saying it like, you ain't nothing but a trailer park white ass bitch. I can say if she meant it to be, you know what I'm saying, malicious, but she didn't say that to be malicious. Hell, her fucking mama white. Shelly just a dumb ass bitch. She always want to take shit to offense, like... 
you know what I'm saying? That's just like a person calling me a bitch. Like I call or uh, me calling my friends a bitch. That's the same thing. Like you can like it's 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 a certain way you say things. In my opinion, it's the way you put things out there. If you saying it to be malicious, then I can take offense to it. But if you saying it in a playful manner, then what's the point of me taking offense to it? Like I call my my friend girls bitches all the time, and they laugh, and because that's something that I say. I even call my friend guys bitches. And, they, and some of them are the most manliest dudes in the world. And if it was any other dude that called them a bitch, you know what I'm saying? They'd be ready to fight them. But I call them a bitch because they know, you know, that's just what I say. I call them bitches and they don't take offense to it because they know that I don't mean anything by them. You know, anything by that. So, that's why they don't take offense to it. This bitch just felt like taking offense to it because she don't like Nastasia. I already see your game, bitch. And then you call her a bitch. Then, you know, she told you not to call her another bitch. You called another bitch. And then she threw a drink in your face and you didn't do shit. You got up and left like a weak bitch. You left like a pussy. Because that's what the fuck you are. A fucking pussy. Because if that was Judy, your ass would have been the first bitch to get up and try to fight somebody. That shows you that you ain't nothing but a weak ass bitch. You ain't nothing but talk. And you like to pick on people that you think and that you know you can beat. That's all I'm saying. Now, a lot of people are saying that Tierra was overreacting about Judy's driving. And I necessarily don't. Even though I'm team Tierra, I don't agree with y'all. Because some of y'all are saying she was overreacting. But trust me, the way Judy was driving, I'd be pissed off too. I don't think I would have gotten to the point where I would have got the contract to beat Judy ass. But I damn sure would have cussed her out. Because bitch, don't drive like that. You got my life and, and two other people's life. And, well, actually, three other people, life, including your own, in your fucking hand. I don't want to die with your ass behind the wheel. I would have cussed her ass out, too. I don't think I would have did all this shit, like, hit her and shit. But I damn sure would have cussed Judy ass out and let her know. I don't play them games. Don't be driving that car stupid like that because I love my life just like you love yours. Don't play on my life, bitch. Don't do that. It looks like Angelique is cool with both sides, but I read a spoiler. And I forgot what episode it was, but it said that she's going to turn on her on her former besties or something. I don't know what episode it was, but it was on Wikipedia. If you don't want to hear that spoiler, just forget I said that. So, I think that's the end of this video. Um, the next video y'all gonna get this week is uh, my testimony, my second my testimony video. Um, I'm gonna film that tomorrow. So, I'm out of here in 5, 4, 3, 2, motherfucking one. Holla.